Hello gamers, today I will tell you exactly how much money Google paid me in the first 8 months after starting a YouTube gaming channel from 0 to 25,000 subscribers. We will go through my analytics and we will break down how much Google gives me per thousand views, how I personally immediately reinvested the first earnings directly into my content and hopefully give you some good suggestions and motivations in case you would like to start publishing your own content. Let's get started. Hello there and welcome to my channel. I'd like to start off with a small disclaimer. Money is a difficult topic to speak about. Not everyone is willing to put their earnings online for everyone to see. Can you imagine somebody walking to you on the street and asking you how much you earned in the past month? Would you tell that? Some people will do that, sure, but let's be real. Most of us will just reply that person to mind his own business. There is a reason why I am making this video. For who is new here, Yes, this is a gaming channel, but I make a different type of content. More than focusing on the gameplay, I talk about probability, statistics, strategies, how to get the most value out of the games you play. If you are an habitual viewer, you already know that, so probably this video is not that surprising to you. I love analytics, I love graphics, that's what made me start this channel in the first place. The reason why I am completely fine in sharing my earnings on YouTube, and we will show that in a moment, is because communities will never ever tell you that you don't deserve what you're earning as long as they feel like you are providing some value back to them. We are not in the early 2000s anymore, people know how the online world works and how much effort and time there is behind one single video. From the research, to the script, filming, editing, creating graphics, thumbnails, after 8 months in getting to know my community I hope that this video to celebrate 25,000 subscribers will be somehow educational and why not motivate some of you viewers. Yes, I'm talking to you watching, don't ignore me, to upload maybe your own content. Alright then, let's explore my analytics. First off, thank you YouTube for finally introducing the dark theme in YouTube Studio, our eyes are so grateful. As you may already know, to activate monetization on YouTube according to the latest criteria, your channel needs to reach 1000 subscribers and 4000 watch hours. This is a crucial requirement to apply for the Google AdSense partnership and start having the ads rolling on your videos. In the moment you reach that and your partnership is approved, you can directly turn on the monetization on every single one of your videos, even the ones that were made before you got your partnership, if you're eligible, of course. If you're new, always remember to check the YouTube guidelines before publishing, but which is the cut that goes into the pockets of the YouTuber when an advertisement is playing before, during or at the end of one of your videos? Well, my friends, it is 55% of what the advertisers, so the people who pay Google to have their ads playing on YouTube, actually pay. Quick concrete example, if an advertiser pays $10 to Google per 1000 monetized playbacks, the most you can get is $5.50, therefore 55% of what the advertiser actually paid. Then we need to make a quick distinction between CPM and RPM. You might have already heard of those acronyms. CPM stands for cost per mile or the cost per 1000 views and tells you how much advertisers paid to get 1000 monetized playbacks on your videos. RPM stands for revenue per mile or the money you actually earned thanks to 1000 monetized views on your channel. RPM will always be lower than the CPM because it is calculated off the share of your revenue and includes views that were not monetized, like people having ad blockers or simply because sometimes the ads don't appear. Anyway, normally for small gaming channels like mine, the RPM is a little bit higher than normal because it is influenced by memberships, super chats and super stickers in case you also livestream your content. Gaming channels are eligible for memberships and supers already at 1000 subscribers, which is a very nice advantage for small creators like myself. CPM and RPM are completely different from channel to channel and from video to video. Depending on their length, the average watch time, how many ads are rolled during longer videos, where people are watching from. For example, viewers from countries like United States, Australia, Germany are the ones who usually boost up the revenue, because in those countries advertisers are willing to pay more to show ads to the viewers, so the CPM is higher. So I published my first video about 8 months ago on December 7th, 2020, and I became eligible for Google AdSense less than one month later, at the beginning of January 2021. 
After a couple processing days, ads started finally playing on my videos and on January 4th, 2021, I officially started earning off my YouTube videos. I am going to speak in Euro because I am Italian, I live in Europe and Google pays me in Euro, but just as a reference, one Euro equals to $1.17. And don't worry, at the end I am going to make a conversion of everything I earned and give you the final amount also in US dollars. On day one, I made a whopping amount of 6 euros and 61 cents and I kept staying under 10 euros for the entirety of week one. You can also see the subscriber count for that specific time frame here on the side. I was getting about 2 to 3 thousand views per day on average and this was the pay cut. On week two things started picking up and as you can see I was making more than 10 euros per day with some peaks at 20 and 30 euros. Things kept growing for the rest of the month, with the lowest on January 9th being 1 euro and 94 cents and a peak of 64 euros and 80 cents on January 25th. The total earnings for my first month of monetizations were 477 euros and 97 cents, which corresponds to about 560 US dollars. Second month, February 2021, views kept rising with 146,000 views in 28 days. You also need to consider that this works like a snowball because the more videos you have on your channel, the more base views you are going to get daily if you are not uploading. In this way, your minimum is going to rise and your average is going to be higher too. The minimum earnings for one single day in February was of 8 euros and 88 cents on February 27th with a peak on February 19th of 92 euros and 90 cents. Total revenue for the second month of monetizations 817 euros and 1 cent, which is about 950 US dollars. Going over month number 3, March 2021, 246,800 views over the entire month with a minimum earning of 16 euros and 42 cents earned on that single day and a peak of 130 euros and 80 cents earned on March 18th. First time for the channel earning more than 100 euros in a single day, corresponding also to the first time I live streamed on my channel. So this amount is comprehensive of super chats and donations on that day. Total amount for March 1,440 euros and 15 cents, which is around 1,680 US dollars for my third month of monetization. Month number four, April 2021. The channel got 418,000 views in 30 days, and I also had the time to make some more live streams as you can see from the timeline. I was locked down because of the pandemic, so I said, yeah, why not make some more videos this month? I also published few guides that month that were lucky to get tens of thousands of views and the total earnings for April 2021 were of 2,551 euros and 35 cents, or about $3,000, with the lowest peak at the beginning of the month on April 5th with 16 euros and 32 cents, and the maximum peak on April 28th with 287 euros and 24 cents on the day I live streamed for eight hours. First and single time I did that on my channel. I'm not sure I'm doing that again anytime soon. In May, I slowed down the content a little bit. I published less videos, getting about 355,000 views in 31 days days with a total revenue of 1,670 euros and 92 cents with a few peaks over 100 euros and minimums around 12 to 15 euros. In June I was out of my country for work two-thirds of the time and I prepared my content beforehand and scheduled the publishing time not to let my subscribers without content. I also started differentiating my content with some other games which of course got fewer views but paid more overall with brand deals, which we are going to speak about later, and I also published new formats of videos like the short format, which of course being short also pay less in terms of revenue, but this is a sacrifice that I was and I am willing to take as long as the community finds the content fulfilling and gives them the value they expect in the shortest time possible. Normally the videos that earn the most are over 8 minutes long, because after 8 minutes in time you have the possibility to act 
activate the so-called mid-rolls, which are basically the ads that are displayed during a video. You can both choose the position or letting YouTube do the work, but usually the longer the video is and the longer people are watching it, the more you're going to earn in terms of ad revenue. That's why you often see videos that are just above 8 minutes in length. I honestly prefer to cut out the dead parts and make a very short video, not to make the viewer feel tired when he or she is watching. Anyway, June 2021, 1490 euros and 47 cents with 280,000 views in total. In July, I had about a 10 day peak in a productive time where I was able to publish content on a daily basis and getting over 20,000 views per day on average, which led the channel to a revenue increase even live streaming one single time in the entire month just for a couple hours. Total revenue 1,976 euros and one cent with almost half a million views during the month. I am not going to speak about August, the month is still ongoing, but you can see all the info on the screen. But I am now going to show you the total money that Google paid me, or will pay me because they pay with one month of delay, since the channel was monetized. So we go over here, we click on custom, and we go back to January the 4th, which you may recall was my first day as a monetized channel earning from YouTube, until August 18th, 227 days selected, we click on apply, here you go, I had a total of 2.3 million views since my channel was monetized, and about 2.5 million views in total, with 213,000 watch hours, which I am curious to see what they correspond to. Of course, if you know me enough, I'm gonna calculate that, it's 213.3 thousand divided by 24 to obtain the days, 8.8 thousand days divided by 365. People watched my channel for 24.34 years. That's crazy. And consider that some YouTubers get this amount of views or more every single day. I am a small fish in the pond. Of course, revenue is varying from channel to channel and from video to video. There are videos with 2 million views which earned 500 US dollars and videos with the same amount of views which earned more than 50,000 dollars. So 100 times more. I have personally seen investments videos with an RPM of over 30 US dollars. If I find some examples, I will just pop them on screen, which is totally crazy, totally nuts, but it can happen, especially on channels speaking about economy or investments. Those are 100% the most paid channels on YouTube per thousand views. Anyway, from zero to 25,000 subscribers. That's why I made this special video and I hope you enjoy. If you do enjoy and if you want more, please leave a like, subscribe and comment down below what you would like to see next alongside my gaming videos. Total revenue of my YouTube videos, 11,352 euros and 72 cents, which corresponds to about 13,250 US dollars. To this amount, we need to add brand deals and sponsorships. For contractual reasons, unfortunately, I cannot tell you who paid me, which amount and when, but nothing says I cannot tell you the total revenue from the brand deals and sponsorships, which, starting from March when I accepted the first one, totals to about $9,000, for a grand total of $22,250. To this number, we need to detract around 25% for tax purposes and other expenses, which is $5,500 and leaves us with about $16,750. Of this amount, I have invested around $10,000 in equipment to make my content better. So as I was earning with YouTube, I was reinvesting my first dollar. You can start off your own content with whatever you get. I was editing my videos on my iPad at the beginning. Editing, voiceover, everything. Instead of editing on my iPad, I invested my money, I assembled a professional PC where I could film and edit my videos, I invested in monitors, in soundproofing the room where I'm recording the video at the moment, electrical work, wiring a new microphone, capture card for my iPad when I'm playing mobile games. I also spent quite a bit of money to hire professionals to make graphics for my channel. Animations, intros, outros, the logo, uh, overlays and several giveaways on my Discord to keep the community engaged and give back to you, which made this little project of mine really possible. After taxes, uh, new equipments and various expenses, I am left with around $6,500 in clean earnings from my channel, 
on my journey from 0 to 25,000 subscribers in the past 8 months. Still, there are many things that we haven't talked about. How you should reinvest your first dollar, how to create your own strategy on YouTube, how to deliver to your community the best version of your content, also how to diversify the sources of your income. Those are all things I've learned in the past month, especially from making mistakes myself and experiencing the consequences of those mistakes on my own skin. If you want me to talk about more about some of these topics, let me know in the comment section down below. The entire purpose of this video was to hopefully motivate you in uploading your own content, whether it's gaming or tutorials or makeup or comedy. If you feel like trying, please do not hesitate. The internet has many flaws, but also many positive aspects, and you can really succeed if you believe in yourself. If you do believe in yourself, people are going to believe in you as well. And they are never going to say that you don't deserve what you worked so hard for. Your gain is not their loss, it just added value. Thanks for tuning in, I wish you a great day. Ciao.